Shalom, y'all. I want you to see this is what one of my customers has. Look at this old thing right here. All right, let's dive inside. So, this Bible is from 1880. Now, they have... They have a lot of information in here before you even get to the scriptures. That right there, that looks like Nero. And then over here, Alexander. And then Lysimachus. So here's the coin of Tyree. This is... I don't know who that is. The coin of Sardis. See, this is all Edomite faces on the money. Penny of Tiberius. See, this is why Christ asked the question, whose face, whose superscription is on the money? Drachma of Archelaus. There's a shekel. Caesar Augustus, the tribute money, that's the, <laughs> that's what Christ is talking about right there. Antiochus Trifon, because you got, you got more than one Antiochus. Matter of fact, the one that we're going over in Maccabees is Antiochus IV, I believe. Then there's a Roman medal. There's a farthing. Look at that coin of Ephesus, Temple of Diana. Look at that architecture. The might of Herod. Now, here's Deuteronomy 28, verse 4 to 8. Therefore shalt thou serve thine enemies. People always saying, oh, see, they done changed that so many times. Everybody used to use the King James, but then all of a sudden they stopped using it. And there it is. Deuteronomy 28, 68. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. And ye shall be sold unto your enemies, and no man shall buy you. But guess what? The most important thing about this. Here it is, the Apocrypha. This is, and this Bible is from 1880. There it is, First Estrus, the Feast of the Passover. Mm. Yep, there it is. And Jesus held the Feast of the Passover in Jerusalem. I mean, Josiah's unto his Lord and offered the Passover. The 14th day of the first month. And the first book of the Maccabees. What does that say? Antiochus gave leave to set up the fashions of the Gentiles in Jerusalem and spoiled it and the temple in it. And set up therein the abomination of desolation and slew those who did circumcise their children. So ain't no excuse when they be talking about they waiting for the abomination of desolation. These people know. Uh, and it happened after that. Alexander, son of Philip the Macedonian who came out of the land of Kittim, had smitten Darius, king of the Persians and Medes, that he reigned in his stead. The first over Greece. Woo, your Edomites. Now, here's a little humor. You got that guy right there, and it says, Our Savior. Now, Revelation. <laughs> there it is. His head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow, and his eyes were as a flame of fire, and his feet like unto fine brass as if they burned in a furnace and his voice as the sound of many 
waters. All right, now let me get back to work. Y'all have a good day. So long.